everyone, my name is Courtney. Today I'm going to be reacting to Joshua Bassett's new EP, Sad Songs in a Hotel Room. And I'm not prepared, but we're, we're gonna we're gonna kick it off with the title track, which is actually like the only one I haven't heard like anything of, I believe. So I'm I'm nervous, but here we go. <laughs> I like the build up to the chorus. Just sad vibes all about. Dang. That's that's such a good um I'm actually playing it again. No, I'm starting LA. Um yeah. What am I gonna say? I, I like that as like the opening. It's it's a nice like it's a nice um introduction into like the vibes of the EP. I'm my heart already like sank. Um, but yeah, I it's a vibe. It's like one of those it's like mm, you know, like you can't really dance to it, but like you can. <laughs> I had no idea what to expect. Like from the rest of the songs, I have like a really good idea of what to expect. That one I was like clueless so yeah it's a vibe the next song in the ep is la which we've all heard before but it's been like one of my favorite unreleased songs so i'm very glad we finally get the recorded version so here we go Ooh, vocals This is such like late night driving vibes. I don't know why. Middle of nowhere. <laughs> version of LA. I I was scared. Not gonna lie, I was a little bit scared, but his vocals just sound so good on it. Like I really like it. They sound really crisp, really polished, and just vibes. Um I I did see some people say that they thought it was more of like a sounded more of like a remix, but I thought it sounded mostly fine. There's a couple things that sounded a little bit cool to me, I guess. I wouldn't say like off, but like cool. And so I really like those um, additions of him and just like the piano. So yeah, that's my take on LA. Next song on the EP is Used To It. Let's go. I've heard this live, but um, I'm excited to hear this song. That is so... That's that's oh, I feel that though. I can relate. That's so sucky. Best. 
play. I love it. This song's such like a vibe. I really like it a lot. I say that about everything. <laughs> but yeah, it's just, it's a really good song about how like you can have really terrible people in your life and like you're literally just so used to it that like you're like, oh, this is normal, but it's not. And yeah, I've had a lot of, I'd say, friendships that were very toxic and you know what I eventually moved on but at the time I was used to it and it was not good <laughs> but yeah vibe I love it guess I got used to it um, next song on the EP is smoke slow which is one of my personal all-time favorites um little self problem here I made a little smoke slow photo shoot on Instagram if you want to check that out my Instagram's linked in my bio but not my bio my description <laughs> Josh says to jump, so you jump. Ready? Oh, pipe's too early. Take the two illusions of the love and never was and never will be anyway. Such a vibe. I love that song. Don't smoke, children. I don't smoke. You shouldn't smoke. It's bad for you and bad for your lungs. Don't do it. Next song is Lifeline, which I actually reacted to right before I made this whole EP reaction because I want to watch the music video first. And it absolutely broke me. So, yeah, we'll listen to it a little bit. So, <laughs> <sighs> this one was also really sad to hear live. It's like, we love moms, though. Moms are the best. The vocals on this one are so good too. That song is so beautiful. I can't. It, ugh, that hurts. That hurts. You guys, final song. All in due time. This one. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, when the first, like, TikTok snippet came out, I didn't vibe with it. I don't know why, but, like, I guess I just, I wasn't feeling it that time in my life. And now, I'm, no, no, let's just listen. My heart. <laughs> it's just, mm, so much. <sighs> like, they shouldn't, he, I'm gonna go better now. Um, that song, it just, it means, it means a lot to me on like so many different levels and I, I just, I can't even put it into words. My DP was an experience and I'm very thankful to have gone on this journey. <laughs> um, yeah, wow. I'm sad and not, but not in a hotel room. So that song's in a room. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's late. I'm tired and I'm running on like no sleep. Um, but yeah, I don't. I I wish I had like. I normally feel like I have a way to like recap everything, but like. I'm genuinely speechless. Like, I don't know what to say. Like, it's just, wow. He really poured his heart into this one. And I'm so excited for the album. Um, I'm so 
excited for Would You Love Me Now and She Said He Said She Said. Those songs are amazing, guys. Like, oh my gosh, from what I've heard of them, they're just, you're gonna love them too. Um, but I'm really grateful for this EP as we're waiting for the album. And anytime I feel like having a mental breakdown, this one of those too. Um, but yeah, that's all I got for today. So thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. It actually makes me happy that people actually like my videos. Um, and also comment down below like what song you like the most, um, which lyric resonated with you. I don't know, just tell me what you thought about the EP in the comments because I like interacting with y'all. And if you feel like hanging out with me more, you can subscribe. I do react to like every Joshua Bassett release, so. Yes, and that has recently also included High School Musical Musical the series episodes, even though season three is over. But yeah, so thank you so much for watching. I love you. Have a wonderful day, and I hope you have a happier day. <laughs> I don't know, but.